Have courage. Jesus is calling us in today's gospel to have courage. Have the courage to publicly acknowledge before others that Jesus is the one to bring peace and justice to our world. Likewise, in the first reading, the prophet Jeremiah calls us to have courage. Have courage in the face of danger and persecution. But I have to admit, I lack courage. I'm afraid. I'm afraid to go to a protest because violence might break out or I might catch the coronavirus. But Jesus is so clear. He says it three times in the gospel. Be not afraid. Be not afraid to acknowledge me and I will acknowledge you before God in heaven. So what does it mean to acknowledge Jesus before others? I think recently Pope Francis gave us one example of how to do that. Acknowledge Jesus by acknowledging the sacredness of all human life. Pope Francis said, let's stop pretending that we revere the sacredness of all human life when we turn a blind eye to racism. So let's acknowledge Jesus by acknowledging the sacredness of all human life, that even the tiniest sparrow is of value.